Hi, this is Monica Jenkins, and I wanted to make a presentation today to teach you how to become a Facebook developer and to understand the changes that Facebook is about to go through again. Um, a few weeks ago, Facebook did a little change, um, and that was really just like a little pebble in the lake to see how we would all react because they're about to make the whole um, page and profile system change again. Um, it's going to go to a timeline look. So I'm going to go ahead and put you on my screen and show you what the new changes are and how if you can become a developer now, you can install it today and start learning how to utilize it to the best of your um, use. Um, so here we go. Alright, so here as you see, this is my uh, regular profile and as you regular know your pictures right here, you have your wall, your friends, and you can subscribe to people now. Okay, so what we're going to do is go up here to the top, type in facebook.com slash developer doc and developers.com, no not developers, but facebook.com slash developers and it'll change to this setting and whenever you first go to this it might need you to actually verify your account with your like um, phone number or credit card possibility but if your um, your phone number should definitely work you don't need a credit card really so it's not that it's going to be like you have to pay for Facebook that's just a super a silly rumor so um, we're going to go ahead and create a new application when you become a, a developer all it is is going to developer.com and being in this so let's see this is Harmony Harmony's time. Okay, here you're going to name it, and you can name it like anything you want. It doesn't matter. It could be Harmon Joe's timeline. It could be timeline. It could be Joe. It could be your cat's name. It does not matter. Like, it's nobody's going to see it. It's just to install it for the first time. So then we're going to have um, app namespace, and you can just do this again but it just has to be an original name and it has to say that it's available and you agree to the policies of course you just have to um, then security Six. O -M -I -L. E -I -L. So this will be creating a new application in their system and for regular other like applications that have been used in the past it's been readily available that we want to use like it's either to use through websites or you want to actually build an application online like you are, might play with all the time. Um, this one's sort of new but um, this is to have a custom iframe tab on the left side of your page. So we'll, I'll go over another video to explain all of that. But for now, we're talking. We're looking up here. We're going to go to this open graph application, and here's where it's just it's completely changing. Okay, so it's really seriously simple. But you just start by defining one action and one object for your application. So you're going to put people can blank a blank and then you get started. So it's super easy. It doesn't matter what you put in here. Um, people can run a marathon. People can watch a video. You know? Okay? So it, it could be anything. This has no no value, but it just is uh it's creating action within Facebook because it's going into the new system. So um, instead of people just I like um, I like TV, I like to watch videos. Um, instead of that, it's gonna be like I watch a video. Like I am watching this, I'm cooking this, I'm running, exercising. Like verbs are now gonna be used through Facebook to give you more customization so that it's actually like what you're doing and what you really um, are getting out of it. So now you install that. It's going to go through uh, three steps right here but you don't have to do any editing to it at all. You just want to scroll down, save your changes and go to next.
taking a little long, but it's all, um, it's just completely changing the way. It's called the timeline. It's Facebook timeline. And what you'll see in a few minutes that it's just going to change the whole view of it. Um, all of this is just putting in the preferences and the system already knows what to do. So, um, again, it's already there. It's going to come up with some more details, but you're just going to scroll down, and save changes, and go to the next step. And again, timeline aggregations, scroll all the way down, save and finish it. So now, it's going to say people like the actions, the objects, and the, the summaries and stuff, but that doesn't even matter right now. Like it just is the background. So we can, oh, you know, wait, sorry. We're going to go to over here on the left and view your application profile page and you can you can like it and since we want to make sure you use these tools in the right way here's an update of how you can connect with your audience to improve the insights you now see new public metrics called people talking about this underneath your fan count to show the number of people on Facebook who have engaged with your page in the last seven days so this is how you're going to be seeing your friends activities with the page so you understand like what's been going on with it so let's see they're going to be they're testing it right now but it'll be reviewed and published more on the 31st of October. So, no big deal, but um, okay, so let's try and go to the facebook.com over here and check out my, this is the home feed now. So it says, introducing the timeline, a new kind of profile. Timeline is your collection of all the photos, posts, and applications that tell your story. To learn about building new social apps for Timeline, visit the developer site. So the, here it shows you already people that have um, installed this. So I have about, what, 15 people in my, my network that know about this right now. So um, it's seriously new, and I'm teaching you right now how to install it into your profile. And let me show you something real quick. This is, um, I'm logged in in Harmony's moment right here. This is my other profile, Ultimate Epic Harmonious Moment, and this is my business. So right now, because this profile was not a developer, like it wasn't in the open graph yet, I still viewed other profiles this way. So now that I've just transitioned it into being a developer profile, it's going to change. So let me show you. So we want to get it now. And this will transfer you into this tab, which is the Harmonies Moment tab, your regular name tab, and this is the new profile. So it's really different. I mean, it's really simple, but it's different, and it's really cool. Um, you, can, let's see, you can take a tour. You can um, publish it now. So this is going to go live on the 16th. So it's not that big of a deal. It's coming soon, but you're going to want to, you can add a cover right here, and you can either use from your regular photos or upload a new photo. So I can show you how it's going to look. And let's see. So many things. All these events I've been to. Hmm. This was a fun one. So many people. So you just want to position it. That's good. And save changes. So now this is your cover picture, and then you have a little one over here. So you have two now. So instead of like that other banner image that was over here, now it's just a big one and a little one. So you can scroll down. This is a timeline, like literally. You can see it's like now, September, August, 2011, 2010, and when you were born. And of course, this only began a few years ago, so all this information is available, but you can actually input it in there. So if you have pictures from when you were born, you can input them back into where your timeline is and go back and customize it. 
so um, other things people are like I don't want all my stuff out there well whatever you were not so proud of like you can go hide so um, you know all this Spotify stuff like it's Spotify's cool but it doesn't maybe need to be like that on my timeline so I can hide it okay so now it's not so prominent and then other things like oh here I produced the video um, how to make your passion go viral so I can edit it and wait no I want to push the star because it's really important to me so if I push the star that makes it so that it goes all the way across my timeline so if somebody's like searching down my timeline oh blah 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 well no this one goes all the way across must be important let me check it out so you can like give uh, extenuation to things that you're really proud of other things like questions or whatever you can hide um, or just totally customize it all these months and you know in between of that there's like post or whatever you did but you can add things in like if you missed like when you had a baby or when you got a job or when you did this or that you can add it in so it's really cool so people know what you're doing and you can be proud of it again because it's not disappeared and so other than that you want to publish this because nobody can really see it until you publish it so you want to go over here to publish now to make it official. So now, this is what my profile looks like. Developer released. And now, I can go here, and I would go to Ultimate Epic Harmonious Moment Profile, and voila! This is what my new profile already looks like. So over here, I wasn't a developer, now I'm a developer and now I see the new profile and like I said they're gonna be releasing this to the public so it's not that you have to become a developer but if you wanna like do business online and grow your knowledge of how to utilize it to um, you know have opportunity to get income and work online like I am I would really think that you um, want to know more about the developer side of Facebook so I encourage you to learn more about it and um, I hope that you can appreciate like me sharing this knowledge with you. I know it's a little um, crazy. Everything's going to be new and different, but it's going to be fun. Um, I think it's really customizable. You shouldn't be scared of it. You should just really accentuate it and love it. And you can also go down here. There's like these four that are the, the top things that people can see. You can, whatever application you had before, like you can. Um, how do you say customize this to be there so it doesn't have to have to be your friends here you can edit it or um, add something else in there so it's fun we'll play with it and I uh, hope that you can appreciate this and learn more soon I'm gonna be launching some other really cool secrets so until then I hope you have a wonderfully prosperous day and remember peace love and harmony thank you